I'm a sculptor and artist, and I have a project I call the Gamelatron Project, which is the marriage of Indonesian sonic and ritual traditions with modern robotics. It's a series of kinetic sculptures that produce sound using traditional instruments from Indonesia. There is a series of like arcade buttons that I source from like old 80s arcade machines and things like that. You press one of the buttons and it triggers a musical sequence. I was just watching a, a child playing and she would go and kind of politely like touch one button and then step back and be kind of shocked, amazed and enthralled by like what happened. And then she would go and try to hit another button and, and see see what happened. So it was this kind of like curiosity, this beautiful curiosity in her that was awakened. The piece is called Sappho's Mirror, number three. Sappho was a Greek poet in ancient times and she wrote this quote that I found really haunting. If you are squeamish, do not prod the beach rubble. I've been working since 2006 by cleaning beaches all over the world of plastic that's coming out of the ocean right now. The mirror is a reflection of ourselves. We use these objects every day. It's sort of a portrait of the sort of global consumer society that we're in right now. For me though, it, it's taken on a literal meaning now with this dark matter, this plastic which is filling the natural world and coming back to haunt us. Unkempt is a photorealistic hair drawing. It's a portrait of someone but I omitted the face. I do pieces of just people's hair to communicate their social economic background without having their face or physical identity get in the way. What I started doing was just doing portraits, if you will, of people and just their hair and letting the audience fill in the face with their own vocabulary. I would describe my pieces as being very sensual, very personal, uh, physically and emotionally intimate. I came to volunteer at the unfair and ended up doing some faux walls and then faux finishes on the floor so they looked like concrete limestone. Looks a little bit more museum quality, I hope. Ha, 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 ha.